my Mio for meet Fred, a fabulous artist. Like, ok, 
okay, this is something that works. Really great idea, good for everybody, good for the animals, good for the people, good for the world. And I think uh, the world can use some more goodness, I think. Wonderful. Voila. Can you give us the name of uh, each artist? Of course. Please. This is Kevin Sengal. It's a young guy and he did not really believe in himself, but I was like, hey, you make beautiful paintings, you have to step out of this don't believe in yourself part and just go for it. So he came to my house and he had a, a fart with him, a map with like maybe a hundred drawings, and I had to select, and I had to select. And I had three stacks, and one stack was like this, other stack was like this, and the other stack was like this. And then from this big stack, I chose seven pieces for the auction because I, I truly believe that people should believe more in themselves and not be afraid. Because if you have skills like this, you can do anything what you want. I, I can't draw like this. I really can't draw like this. This is Zik. He's a friend of mine when I was younger and he makes the most beautiful stuff. And he donated this and it's called Blade. And it is a dog of, uh, of one of his friends that he painted. But I like it very much. It's very simple, but I like it. And his artist's name is Zik. Then this is uh, Daniel Osterman. He's a Dutch graffiti guy, a family of the great Ton Hermans, who, who is a, a cabaretier guy from Holland. Really funny man. Already died, but really funny. This is a Buri Burmans. He's from Portugal, actually from Belgium, but he lives in Portugal with his wife and two children. He makes collages, and I really like it. He made it especially for Poco. But it's an ugly frame. I didn't choose the frame, <laughs> but it's an ugly one. This is uh, Luz van Delft. Luz van Delft is from Holland. She makes pop art and she's like, if you Google her, she's famous. And she donated two pieces. I added the candle because I thought it would be funny. Ah, uh, yes. Very cute. Oh, yes. This I love is, that. This is the Joachim, the Belgian artist, and he's like, I think he's going to be very famous in what he does because he's the one, he, he only does faces like this, very cobra like, very infantile like, like childish, you know? But it's a style of art that I like very much, it's cobra. Um, he's signed by a London gallery, he's on his way to become a really big artist but he's very modest. Modestry is like something we all should cherish, I think. This is Perishable Rush. He's from Holland. Um, he makes really good stuff. You should check him out. He's like a fantastic artist and a fantastic person. I didn't know him before before the charity. That's my telephone, I think. I didn't know him for the, before the charity. I told him about the charity and he was like straight away Yes, I want to participate. I want to help out. This is Edo Rat. Edo Rat comes from Rotterdam, Rotterdam in Holland. And he was also like straight away, oh yeah, what a cool idea. I want to donate something. This is uh, Sana Bunny Brigade classes. She used to live in Belgium, but now she lives in Holland. I asked her and she also said immediately she yes. had to make from her doctor every day a painting. So she donated this one, and I like it very much. It's a collage, but it's also a little painting. This is a Michael Noll. Noll. He comes from Breda in Holland also. I asked him, and he was like straight away, yes. So everybody that I asked, they were always like, yes, we want to help out. Artists are not egoist people, are not arrogant people. They're just so people, this people. This is a Friedrich Schneiders. He makes the most fantastic pen drawings of models. He's like a, a true artist, he's also a singer, he's like, he can, whatever he does, he can do it. I'm a big fan of the guy. This is Stéphanie Maillard, she comes from Anvers, but she speaks French at the house, she's francophone, she's Belgian, she's Belgian, she's Belgian, she's Belgian like us, but she speaks French in the house, and here only everybody speaks French, but this is called Underwater Love. This is a disaster. It's cardboard and it's pinky in the brain. Google it, YouTube it. Ask your children what it is, they will know it. 
It's a cartoon. It's a very good cartoon. Minus et cortex. This is in French. What? In French, minus et cortex. Ça, je sais pas. Uh, this is a Tim Van Vliet, it's a special technique of uh, photography, it's light photography. So what does it do? It's uh, with uh, the closing time of the camera, it goes really slowly. Yes. And then it goes with lights, and that's, that's this. It looks like water, but it's lights. And then this oh. is mine, but it's not important. This is uh, Oxy Alinsky, and it's uh, uh, a Rembrandt, it's a famous painting. And it does only like pink aliens, only that. If you drive your car in Holland, check out the bridges, check out uh, empty walls. If you see a pink character, it's probably you. Oh. This is uh, Andre Babenko, and he uh, heard about the charity and he just donated. I ha didn't have to ask him anything, he just donated the piece. And normally this goes for a thousand euros, something like that. So you can get a good deal on paintings here. This is Benjamin Murphy, he comes from England. Normally he makes like art made out of electrical tape, but this is pen, pen drawings. I really like his job. I really like what he does, he's uh, original. And I think you should be original. If you do something, you should be original. This is uh, Rudy Trouvé, and Rudy Trouvé is a former guitar player or bass player of the rock band Dave. Yes. And, uh, I don't know the guy, he just uh, heard about the charity and he wanted to participate. So, uh, was that? Oh yeah, cool, thank you. This is uh, Benjamin Quinton Peters, a uh, Belgian graffiti guy, and he makes, he makes fantastic stuff. I can't explain what he makes, but he makes really fantastic stuff. And this is, uh, I don't know what it's called, it's what it is, but it's called Insomnia. I don't know why, but I like it. <laughs> this is a Django Jim, and he is actually a, a cartoonist, and he makes posters for uh, big cultural uh, institutions in Belgium, and he works for the Belgian television. Oh. So he makes uh, cartoons for the Belgian television. And the this is uh, the brother of Vitalski. Vitalski is a famous network poet. Uh, uh, words, artists, something like that. And it's a called, it's a Serge Bakke, and he's the father of Sugar the Cat. If you Google Sugar, you will love it. It's the best comic book ever made. Really, no shit. Thank you for responding to my question. Uh, it's no problem, it's been my pleasure. It's been my pleasure to organize something for Apopo because I think the world needs some better news than with what we are getting today on the news. Everything is bad and this is good, so thank you very much. Hero rats, hero rats, fighting for mankind. Hero rats, hero rats, sniffing out landmines. Hero rats, hero rats, armed with tiny claws.